with our current screening guidelines, um, we catch aneurysms before they reach a size threshold where they rupture. So the size threshold for repair for aneurysms is around 5.5 centimeters. It's a minimally invasive procedure. Uh, a standard open surgery would be a long uh, incision on the abdomen. Instead of that, we do percutaneous puncture in the groins to allow access uh, up into the aorta and slide instruments and catheters uh, from a minimally invasive approach. Improves quality of life immediately after surgery. It reduces hospital stay, so it reduces cost for the hospital. It allows the patients to go back to the loved ones sooner. And most importantly, it provides a mortality benefit. We also use EVAR as an overarching term to also imply an endovascular technique to repair any of the disease in the aorta the iliac arteries or sometimes even in the leg arteries. For example, sometimes patients can have aneurysms in their popliteal artery behind the knee. So we can employ endovascular techniques to repair this by putting a stent graft and these patients actually go home the same day. This allows us to maintain our ability to provide adequate care, uh, excellent care. Our next step really is to treat ruptures with, uh, with an endovascular technique because that the, the mortality benefit from that is astounding compared to the old-fashioned open repair.